So what's up guys, we got a new construction start up here. I have yet to see one of these in the field. I have seen them. Um, this is Carrier, well this is a Bryant, but this is their new blower setup. It's a different setup. Variable speed motor. Um, this one does have reheat for dehumidification. Um, got our two solenoids there. Uh, we got uh, blower speed control here. I have to figure how to set that up. We've got uh, doing a startup today, basically. Jade Honeywell Jade controller. Uh, looks like a low ambient kit there. Your typical carrier gas side. We're really just starting the gas up today is all they wanted, but not a bad little setup on this new Bryant unit. Here's your economizer actuator. Same old carrier look. I see that being a problem. Those are our, that's our hot gas for the reheat coil. Um, that's gonna rub out on the top of the unit, so it's a problem waiting to happen. Uh, everything else looks pretty good. Um, TXV back there. That's another problem. That's an install issue right there. But you're gonna have that because have that on every install. They ran right up through the economizer here. Which that plate there stops it so the economizer shouldn't pinch it, but probably need a grommet on that. Uh, so I currently have no power. I'm gonna have to go down and get with the electricians and see uh, if they can give me power. Uh, nice new plastic fan blades they're using. A little bit different. So, let's go down and see if we can't get power and get this thing started up. First things first, I got power on. Um, well, power's not on here. Power's to my disconnect. Um, we are going to correct our taps are running about 214 volts so I'm gonna get a better 24 volts if I'm connected to the 208 so we're gonna do that first my second transformer here will do the same thing I'm guessing that's the heating transformer um, and then Turn the gas on. I'm just slowly bleeding out of my inlet pressure here. Uh, and then we're just gonna check and verify our gas pressures. It's kind of bright up here, so um, that's my inlet. So it's not much pressure. It's gonna be fine. Yeah, seven seven and a half or so inches water column that should be fine so i'm gonna bleed all the air out of the line until i can smell some gas up here and then we'll jump her out set up the economizer module and we're only starting up the heat today like i said i've only been told to start up the one even though i've got five other units four other units no there's five Got the supply blocked off with the return thing, so um, we're gonna start up here in a second and not smoke them out of the building so nobody freaks out. And then uh, put her together, we'll take a temp rise and let her go. So gas lines bled. They're reading about the same seven. Sorry, blurry guys. It's fucking bright out here. Seven point seven inches water column. First, turn our power on. Turn our power up. We'll go ahead and check our low voltage now. 27 volts. The sun's really killing me. So, we've got an amp clamp on the blower motor. We're going to amp draw on the inducer motor. Looks like she's ready to start up. We'll go ahead and jump her out. Oh, 
Oh, no. Right there. Gotta turn it on. Oh, this helps to have the gas valve turned on. smoke floating around. Let's see if we can't get a blower here. Should. Hopefully. There it goes. See more hit the subscribe button we'll see y'all in the next one